Studios Cafe and Cantina. <laughs> and you know, this is a great format. I love all of the memorabilia they got on the walls. It's really incredible. When someone comes into Trace Amigos Cantina, they can expect a classic Tex-Mex menu and a full-on ZZ Top experience. I've grown up all my life listening to ZZ Top. Love their music. It's got great memorabilia inside here. So uh, come here and check it out. And, uh, drink a few margaritas. I first learned of ZZ Top at the Arizona State Fair. I believe I was about eight or nine years old. And I won a ZZ Top poster in one of the carnival games, which we have prominently displayed on the wall at Trace Amigos. And inadvertently, that was the beginning of my collecting. Just growing up, that was a popular band, obviously, they were a Houston band, but good music. You know, they just had a very different style about them. ZZ Top, the little old band from Texas. This is Sharp Dressed Man. This is the sheet music for Sharp Dressed Man. ZZ Top's music is very blues-based, rock and roll. The first ZZ Top album that I bought was ZZ Top's first album, and I think that was the beginning point where I started really becoming an avid collector. I think people have an amazing reaction when they come in. They really become super nostalgic and kind of take back on uh, memory lane with uh, you know everything that meant everything to them as far as the band goes. Back in the teenager, loved all their music, and it's really cool with them being from Houston. They're just iconic here in Houston. This is their hometown, so uh, we see them in different places all all the time. Fandango, I listened to when I was in fifth grade. And Lord, take me downtown. ZZ Top Hush. We didn't know what that was about. We were fifth grade, man. But we just liked the music. We liked the guitar and the, the, the electric and everything about it. I met Billy Gibbons years ago at the Ready Room, randomly. And over the years, we've just become friends. Although Billy has no business involvement with Tris Amigos, we share a commonality as far as supporting the St. Jude Foundation. Hi, welcome to Tres Amigos. The majority of our proceeds benefit St. Jude's Foundation. We're committed to give 75% of our proceeds for the life of this concept to the foundation. We chose St. Jude because St. Jude is one of the foundations that I really feel like the majority of their proceeds are dedicated to the people that truly need their help. There's no question. I think all of us agree that ZZ Top are the little old band from Texas, but absolutely the legendary champions of our state and just represent everything we are about in the state of Texas.